It's finally Friday, Millers. Let's go. Let's get into some the show. Sophomores and juniors, are you interested in attending the Summer Scholars Program at Notre Dame University? Summer Scholars participants spend two weeks on Notre Dame's campus taking a college-level course taught by Notre Dame faculty. Financial aid is available and the deadline to apply is admission is February 13th. Visit precollege.n.edu for application materials for, and for more information. Students interested in traveling to Germany, Switzerland, France, and the Netherlands over spring break 2024, there will be an informational meeting Tuesday, December 6th at 7 p.m. in Mrs. Gilbert's room. See Mrs. Gilbert in room 2210 for trip information. If you're interested in taking a trip to Japan during the summer of 2024, there will be an informational meeting on November 16th at 6 in room 2061. Make sure to RSVP to the meeting by scanning the QR code. For any questions, contact Ms. Berryman. Now to Trending Today. Welcome back to Trending Today. Life has been pretty eventful. The new Black Panther movie is coming out this Friday in theaters all around, and the Indianapolis Zoo just had a new baby tiger named Helena. Helena is a Siberian tiger. That's all for Trending Today. Now let's toss it over to Meetings with Sane. Key Club is holding a meeting during AL on November 11th in the LGI room. Request an e-hall pass from Mrs. Obremski to attend. Students for Life will be meeting on November 17th during AL in room 1247. Request a pass from Mrs. Ellis to attend. The Fashion Club is having a meeting on November 15th in room 1254. Again, request an e-hall pass from Mrs. McCann before the meeting. The Film Production Club is holding a call-out meeting today in Mr. Kenley's room 1203 during AL. Request an e-hall pass to attend. Who's ready for sports? I guess. All right. Well. Let's go to sports then. Good morning, NHS, and welcome back to Fine Arts Friday. For our news this week, Wind Ensemble, one of the bands, is performing next Friday at East Middle School. And the Theater Department's production of Chicago is next Thursday, Friday, and Saturday at 7 p.m. each. Get your tickets now at nhscpo.org. This Monday and Tuesday, there's going to be the indoor percussion tryouts. Show up from 4 to 6. And that's all the news. So it's time for our guest artist, the marvelous Mitra Morgan. Woo! Hi, uh, I'm Mitra Morgan. I am an artist. I do drawing, I do painting. I also do a lot of pottery. I've been drawing since I was about 10 years old. Um, I started drawing because my sister used to do a lot of drawing. And I would always like look at her sketchbooks and I thought it was like just the coolest thing ever. And so I started drawing myself. I didn't really start painting until about a few years ago, maybe the beginning of high school, and then I started doing ceramics um, last year in Ceramics 1, and I just thought it was a lot of fun. Um, I love making art a lot because I find it's a really methodical process, and so it's really relaxing to do it, and also being able to like look at something that you've made and like feel a lot of pride because you really like it and it's usually turned out pretty well. Um, I think that's pretty cool. Um, yeah. Wow, she was really an arty artist. That's it. Peace out, Nick Jess. Peace out. Bye! It is finally sports, Millers. Let's talk about some Millers sports ball. Millers have made history again this week. Ava Bramblett has been selected as the year's Indiana Miss Soccer. In her total four year with the soccer team, they've had 70 wins, two ties, and five losses. Ava will be the third Noblesville student to ever be selected as soccer player of the year. Congratulations, Ava. You certainly deserve it. Now let's toss it over to the pros for pro sports. Welcome back to Pro Sports Millers. The Pacers almost clutched out a win against the Denver Nuggets, but ended up selling in, in the final couple of plays with a final score of 122 to 119. The Pacers move on with a surprising record of five and six. That's all for Pro Sports today. Let's toss it over to sports meetings. The boys track and field will be holding a call out meeting on December 2nd during AL in Coach Kenley's room. You can request a pass from Coach Kenley or Coach Muvik to attend. If you can't attend or need any more information, contact Coach Glob. Goodbye, Millers. Oh, and in case I don't see you, 
Good afternoon, good evening, and good night. Thank you.